friends, hello everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Myself Neha. I am an accounting trainer, blogger and blogger. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Name of my YouTube channel is Let's Talk About Accounting. In this channel, you will get to know all about accounting concept, knowledge about tally ERP9, then what is GST e-filing, what is income tax e-filing and many other concepts related to accounts. Okay friends, now our today's topic is what are non-cash expenses? Okay. So today's topic is based on that what all is included in profit and loss account that is expenses and which are non-cash items. Okay, so let's start with a video. A non-cash expense is an expense for which there is no related cash outflow in the same period. Okay, so you have in incurred that expense but you have not paid any cash for incurring that expense. It is known as non-cash item. Okay, so the most common example of non-cash expenses are depreciation and amortization. For these items, the cash outflow occurred when a tangible or intangible asset was initially acquired, while the related expenses are recognized months or years later. Okay, so in addition, an accrued expense may be recorded for which the related cash expenditure is in the following period. So, what are non-cash expenses? So, the example first is depreciation and amortization. As you know that uh, on tangible and intangible assets, we provide depreciation as well as amortization. So this we realized in profit and loss account, but we have never incurred cash for these expenses, but still it is being shown in profit and loss expense. Okay. So that expenses are known as non-cash expenses. Another example is accrued expenses. Okay. So the expenses which are accrued, but we have not paid in this current financial year, we are going to make that payment in another financial year but that expense was for the current period and so it is necessary for us to realize those expenses and that are known as accrued expense so even we show that in profit and loss account okay so that is also non-cash expense only so non-cash expenses appear on an income statement because accounting principles require them to be recorded despite not actually being paid for with Cash. The most common example of a non-cash expense, as I said earlier, is depreciation, where the cost of an asset is spread out over time, even though the cash expense occurred all at once. Okay, so are non-cash expense tax deductible? So yes, depreciation is a non-cash tax deductible expense and can make up a significant portion of total expenses on a company's income statement. So we get the benefit of tax. Okay, so as you show more expenses, there will be less taxation. So depreciation is being shown in profit and loss account and yet hence non-cash expenses are tax deductible. Is bad debt a non-cash expense? Yes, again yes. Since a bad debt write-off is a non-cash transaction, the addback occurs based on the net change in receivables. If you create your own cash flow statements, there is no harm in explicitly spelling out bad debts as an addback similar to depreciation expense. So for bad, bad debts also the amount which we are not supposed to recover, okay, which will never be recovered in future also, we realize it as expense and that too the name will be bad debt, okay. So again that is non-cash transaction only. So again I would like to tell you if you have cleared with the concept of what are non-cash expenses. So the examples of non-cash expenses are depreciation, un amortization, unrealized gain, unrealized loss, impairment expenses stock based compensation, provision for discount expenses, deferred income taxes. Okay friends, so this was about non-cash expenses. I hope you must have understood this accounting term, what are non-cash expenses. Okay, so friends, if you have liked my video, do like it, comment it and subscribe my YouTube channel for more accounting related videos. Thank you so much.